guys, it's Running Kimono. So I did a tiny little Walmart haul yesterday, um, and I'm gonna talk about it in a quick second. But first off, we're gonna talk about Walgreens. Um, I did a deal, and I actually got this to work, and I'm gonna explain how I did it. And this is the coupon. Um, it's a $5 register reward on your next purchase when you spend 25. Now I know that um, Dawn's deals went and tried to do it this morning and it didn't work for her, but I'll explain what I did. And honestly guys, if you have a store that's an absolute and hard and fast know about everything, I would recommend to pass on it and just do smaller deals. But if your store is nice and they will work with you, or if you have no problem calling customer service and explaining your case, I would say absolutely go for it. But um, if you're kind of new to this or you're just not sure, I would say, hey, do smaller deals. Don't go for this monster basket because possibly, you know, you're gonna have issues where it's not gonna print, but I got it to print today and I'm gonna explain how I did it. So guys, all of this merchandise is um, after coupons about $40. I used 20,000 points. That's the most I could use. I paid $20 plus tax. And then I got back $23 in um, e both register rewards um, points. I got 4,000 points for the secret. And I'm also going to get a dollar back from Saving Star for the Dixie every day. So these are 17 items after everything is said and done, factoring the points that I used. It's like I paid a dollar for each product, which is absolutely fantastic. So we're gonna talk about the nitty gritty of this and I'm gonna dissect it one at a time and then explain the basket, how I did it. But first let's do a weather report. It's a rainy, miserable one today. My husband took down all of the Christmas decor, so the holidays are officially over. And uh, yeah, cooler one today. But anyhow, hi to my mom if she's watching. And uh, let's get right into um, Walgreens. So as explained earlier, guys, um, I bought, this was like, I think like before coupons, probably $60 of merch. And there's a lot in here. And I wanted to do it as one larger basket to see if this would work. Cause I know that the idea is just to get 25, but I think that with this, there's something goofy about it that um, you can't just buy 25 on the nose. I mean, unless other people are doing it, but I saw that it didn't work for Dawn. So I just thought that I would buy a very large basket and after coupons, if it would work, if it would not work, you know, um, I would just roll the dice with that. And then sure enough, this showed up and this is the register reward that you're looking for. So um, I'm gonna dissect everything uh, one by one and then I'm gonna give you the overall uh, bigger basket uh, of what I did. First offer that we're gonna talk about is the Secret Dry Spray. Uh, these guys are $6.99 on a BOGO 50% off. So grabbing four of them is $20.97. Now we have a buy one get one free in the January PNG. I used two of those. So it dropped it down to $8.99 out of pocket. Um, I got back 4,000 points, making it $4.99 for the four or $1.24 each. Because I did such a massive, massive basket, uh, for whatever reason, my first $5.99 coupon came off and the second one didn't even appear on the receipt. So the manager had to give me um, an extra 5,000 points post, which was cool. Um, also, the first thing this morning, I and this showed up after I left the store, there is a $5.99 coupon when you buy two, so load that to your store card. But also, watch that um, receipt like a hawk, like go through it very carefully because you do not want to be paying a lot more for something and a $5.99 coupon, you absolutely need that thing to come off because it would suck to pay, you know, to only get to use one because you want to use two, obviously. The next deal that I did was I got two of the Dixie every day for, for on a buy one, get one free. So it's $3.99 for the first, the second one's free, and there's a dollar off two coupon that works for this. Um, so I paid $2.99 out of pocket, and then Saving Star has a dollar back when you buy two rebates, so I automatically have already submitted for that because my Walgreens card is attached to my Saving Star account. So it makes it $1.99 for two or 99 cents each, which is a fantastic price point.
And I kind of changed it up here, guys, where I went with um, toothbrushes instead of toothpaste because I have way too much toothpaste in my stockpile. So these are the ones that you're going to be wanting to look for. They are the Oral-B 3D White. And uh, they are $2.99 this week. So for three of them, it's a price point of $8.97. We had a dollar digital coupon for this, plus I had two physical coupons from the um, January PNG that I used for this. So that's $3 that came off. Um, I paid $5.97 out of pocket, and then I got back a $5 register reward. So it made it 97 cents for the three or 32 cents each. And definitely I think toothbrushes is the way to go because of that dollar coupon in the PNG. You can do a lot more because we get toothpaste all the time, but not toothbrushes for that cheap. Then I went and got some of these nice products. They are buy one, get two for free. And we use this for the kitty um, litter box. Um, so this is $2.79 for the first. The other two are for free. And I had a register reward from the DiGiorno deal last week that I used for this. So I basically made $0.79 cents for the three. And that was just kind of smart uh, to do it that way. Now the Olay deal, these guys are two for 12. We have dollar coupons from the um, January P&G. And what I did guys was I went for the bar soap because I noticed it was tagged. And we often get deals for the liquid, um, the liquid body wash, but we never get deals on bar soap. And my mother-in-law really likes this, so I went with the bar soap today. So these guys are two for 12. I used $2 coupons from the January PNG. There was also a digital two off a of two that showed up this morning. So if you don't buy inserts, or if you don't you know, buy the newspaper, you could do it that way. I used 10,000 points and got back this $5 register reward. So it makes it 250 a piece, which is not too shabby. Is this even gonna focus? There we go. So there's my register reward. And then the final. Final deal that I did was I grabbed two of the Charmin essentials. And just to let you guys know, for whatever goofy reason, these are ringing up for $6.99, not the price point of $4.99. So when you see the cashier ring it up, if it's ringing up for $6.99, you have to get them to do a modification because that's an error. And then I got a Bounty Essential that rang up for $4.99. So three of these products is $14.97. I used um, dollar coupons from the January PNG for both of the Charmins and then a dollar one for the Bounty Essential. So $3 came off. I paid $11.97 out of pocket. I basically used 10,000 points, paid $1.97 out of pocket, and then got back this $3 register reward. So that was really fantastic. And you know, um, toilet paper, paper towels, this is the sort of stuff that we always use. And I have um, some in-laws that are always like, you know, looking for this sort of stuff. So I have no problem with that. So guys, of crazy what I did I just knew that this um I just knew that there would be an issue with this I thought you know Don did a smaller basket earlier today and I thought you know what I'm just gonna try this on its own to do all of this in one transaction and yes it will be a little bit out of pocket for me but maybe this will print and yeah it did in fact print so I bought all of this stuff in one transaction and just to walk you through it um, after coupons, all of this was like $40 and I used 20,000 points right off the bat right there. So I had to pay $20 plus tax for all of this. I got back $18 in register rewards, 4,000 points for the secret, and I'm going to get a dollar back from saving star. So if you consider those points, if you want to just factor that back in from the $40 subtotal, it's like after every, all of those, um, all of the $23 of rewards, it's like I paid $17 for all of this and it's 17 products. So it's basically a dollar per item, which is like 
really fantastic. You can swing a larger basket like this, you will need two PNG inserts. I think this is the way to do it. And that's how I got um, this goofy thing to print. And yeah, um, alternatively, you can ask at your store for them to credit you the 5,000 points if it's not printed, or you can try with customer service. But I think a lot of us know the avenue of going through a store or customer service, especially if it's a strict store, it depends who you get on the line at customer service. And then the other aspect of that at your store, if they're not coupon friendly, they'll just say, oh, you use coupons or, oh, it's just not working. You'll have to call customer service. So you kind of know your store the best. And I would recommend doing a much larger basket. That's how I got it to, to do, to, to work. Um, maybe in the comments, if you guys are doing baskets for exactly 25 on the nose, using points and coupons, if you can share and let us know if it's working for you. I obviously like went crazy with this, but um, maybe we can share, share, share in the comments of what is and is not working. And when um, my inserts arrive, hopefully they arrive earlier this week, um, I'm going to try and do maybe just Olay and then something else really small like this and then see if it works and I'll let you guys know. But this is kind of like up in the air. So if you guys can let us know in the comments, it's probably like the smartest avenue to take. Okay guys, so let's talk about Walmart really quickly. Um, I bought two little clearance items that I found because the store was less congested and it was easier to navigate on a Saturday night. So 50% off of clearance merch, this little um, Santa's Village Holiday Walmart Super Center. It's so sweet, it's so super cute. It was um, $7 and 46 cents. And then this nostalgic Christmas tree, I wanted to get one of those. Original price point was 25 and it was down to 12.50. The rumor on the street, guys, is that on Tuesday, December the 31st, the Christmas merch is supposed to hit 70 and then possibly 90, but I think it's probably going to get cleared really quickly. My store, you know, all of those gift sets and then a lot of the hand soap and, you know, stuff that we like to stock up for as couponers, it's all been cleared even at 50% off, which kind of floors me, but hey, I guess people needed to get their uh, shopping on. <laughs> Okay, so the first items that I grabbed for my little haul at Walmart was two of the simple products. This guy was $9.22, which is a little bit out of pocket, and then some wipes for $4.46. So talking about so talking about this guy for right off the bat, $9.22. I had a $2 Peely affixed to the box. I paid $7.22 out of pocket. I bought it, gave me back $1.50. I got $2 back from Saving Star. 200 points back from Shopkick. $2 back from Checkout 51, plus a 50 cent bonus from Checkout 51 for buying two simple products, making it 22 cents for this moisturizer. Not too bad. Wipes were $4.46. I had a $2 Peely also on that, and um, I paid $2.46 out of pocket. I bought as giving back a dollar as is Saving Star, as is Checkout 51, making this free plus a 54 cent money maker. How fantastic. These were both basically free after this little money maker. These Nors Heat and Serve Rices are $1.50 a piece. Um, so for three of them, that's $4.50. My Checo 51 rebate, I think it was like a dollar back when you buy three or something like that. It was gone, so I couldn't even apply to that. Um, for Fetch, I had like buy five of these, get back a dollar, and I was three short. So with the purchase of this, I got back my dollar from Fetch. I got back 50 cents for each of these from Ibotta. Plus Saving Star gave me back 75 cents for buying two. So it made it at the end $1.25 for these three or 41 cents for each. The ramen noodles, this is a great little deal. Uh, these guys are 88 cents each. So for two of them, that's $1.76. Ibotta has um, a rebate for 75 cents back for each. So I got $1.50 back guys. So it made it 26 cents for the two or 13 cents for each um, cup of noodles.
And then the Pringles Wavy, uh, these guys were $1.44. I had to pay that out of pocket and Ibotta has a $1.44 rebate when you buy the Pringles Wavy. So it basically makes it a free item. And then I grabbed a Gatorade Zero. This guy was a dollar on the nose. And um, Fetch Rewards has 500 points back when you buy one of these. So basically made it 50 cents for this little drink. And with the cold and flu season coming around, definitely need some of these liquids in the house, especially if you get the flu. Um, just a great little haul and nothing too heavy. Um, I just wanted to get a couple little rebates going to finish like, you know, um, a couple different levels on Ibotta and, you know, the, the weekends, whatever they have, like little uh, perks and that sort of stuff. So this was just really fantastic. Some of the items that I grabbed over at uh, good old Walmart. That's it for this video, guys. As always, thank you so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.